These are indeed the best working glitches right now for Black Ops 6 after the patch. So let's get straight into it. Drop a like, subscribe, and let's begin. I load up my gun and I'm ready to go. I got a glitch in my pocket, it's a camo show. Why stick to the map and no one knows I'm there? Cause I take out my enemies without any cow. I've equipped Mr. Gold and my weapon without even having it unlocked. You can do this method for the other mastery camos as well. And the best part is it's going to be saved as a custom blueprint for the rest of your life. Even if this glitch gets patched, you'll still have that camo. So you must do this right now because the patches are coming indeed tomorrow. But you can always subscribe so you get the newest after patches straight away. So you're going to be making two classes. One with the weapon that has the camo and then another one that has the weapon that you want to put the camo on. So for this instance, I'm going to be using the gold camo on the Jackal PDW because this is what I've got gold unlocked on and I'm going to be transferring it to this weapon over here. So let's begin. So on the first loader, come down and put the gunfighter wild card, then go back to the weapon and create a new build. Now from here, listen carefully because you might have a little bit of a problem like I did if you don't listen to this part. When you're creating a new build, make sure you select any weapon, but make sure you select more than five attachments when you're creating the new build. So right now we're gonna put more than five attachments Put any attachment, it doesn't matter. Just make sure it's more than five so that gunfighter is activated and that's it. So just put as many as you want. So I'm gonna put eight. And then also before you back out, make sure the camo has the camo that you're gonna be putting on. So I'm gonna be putting Mystic Gold on and then that's it. It. Now when we back out guys, I'll show you what I meant. If we go to the build we just created, you can see the gunfighter perk right there. You can see right there, we've got that little gunfighter picture. You need that to do this glitch. And the only way is by putting more than five attachments. So make sure you do that. Now we're gonna go to the second class and go down and make sure we've got the overkill wildcard selected. So that one right there, make sure that's in. And then now we're gonna go to the weapon that we wanna put um, the camo on, select that one. So select this camo. And now this is where it goes into the glitch moment. So once you've equipped the weapon, you wanna put the camo on, go back to equip another weapon. And we're gonna go to the weapon uh, build that we just created. So this one right here with a gunfighter emoji thing right there. We're gonna select that one, but we're not gonna actually select it. We're gonna equip it and open gunsmith. As you can see in the bottom left corner, that's what we're going to be doing. Equip weapon, open gunsmith. We're going to press that very quickly and go into the camera section as fast as possible. Ready, set, go. So I press square, then R1, customize, and go over to the zombie section because that's where my camera is. And then on the top right, it says undo. I'm going to press that as quick as possible. And if I was quick enough, then I go over to my camo, I select my camo, and you'll see it change into my gun just like that. And now from here, I just go ahead and play. It's already saved as a custom build, so no further steps required. Just go ahead, play, have fun. I found a glitch and let me tell you, man, it's giving me superpowers. I'm Superman. I'm sticking up on enemies. They don't know I'm there. That's because I'm in God, man. I never play fair. I'm at the top. Finally got a true god mode glitch in Black Ops 6 Zombies and it takes place on Liberty Falls. We're gonna have a break from Terminus and focus on the god mode glitches in Liberty Falls, which makes things a lot more interesting. So I'm gonna be showing you exactly how to do this in this game. It's actually not as hard as you think. It's very, very easy. And you can do it before round five. Okay guys, so you're gonna come this way and open up this door. And once you run up these stairs, you'll see right over here, you'll see a little valve. Come and take this, just hold square or X on Xbox and take it. All right, then make your way over here to the Liberty Lanes and open up this door. And just one more step, so come over here exactly where I go and place the valve, or actually punch this off. Then place the valve, hold it to turn it once, and that's it. So from the moment you leave this door, you're going to count to 10 Mississippi from when you're going to come back and sprint inside to turn the valve once more. So once you leave, start counting to 10 Mississippi, and then by the time you get to 8 Mississippi, 8 Mississippi, 9 Mississippi, 10 Mississippi, you'll see the water pressure going down, and this is a point where you want to run inside and sprint back to the valve as fast as you can. And when the screen stops being white, that's when you want to turn off the valve, but make sure it's not too white because it's going to stay like that, and make sure it's not fully clear yet, because then you can't do God mode, you have to do the whole process again. So you wanna turn off the valve when it's a little bit hazy like you can see on screen right now, that's a perfect amount. So unfortunately you have to stay in this room to stay in God mode, but if you do need to go anywhere, come to this pressure valve and make the water pressure come to about just under 100%, so you'll see where I'm about to stop right here. And then that will give you enough time to go and do whatever you need. For example, I'm gonna go and pack a punch my weapon. Now I'm gonna try and make it as fast as I can because as you can see, it's gonna disappear soon. I have to make it back before it actually runs out. So as you can see, I'm running back and I need to get into the room before it goes to the big bang flash. If it does and I don't make it, then that's all good. All we're going to need to do is do the glitch again. But as you can see, it gave me more than enough time to go into the pack-a-punch and now I'm back in the room. I'm still in God mode. 
I definitely recommend going ahead and uh, maxing out your weapons, getting all your perks, doing all the stuff that you need before coming into God mode. And as for ammo, there's an ammo box literally right here. So you're all set for that as well. But the glitches, yeah, they don't last forever. Soon they'll be patched and we'll have to remember that's only until a new glitch is found. Maybe Activision will focus on hackers now. Glitches get bitches in Modern Warfare 2. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to get three weapons in your inventory on any map in Zombies. Look at this. So to start off, you just need two any weapons and go to any ladder on the map. Now when you get to the ladder, hold the weapon in your hand and then go towards the ladder as you're about to climb it. The same time as you're about to climb it, you pull out your knife. So on PlayStation, you hold R3 and then you see that the knife is equipped when you get off the ladder. That means the glitch has worked. And all you do now is go buy a weapon off the wall while holding that knife. Don't change weapon just yet. Go buy a weapon just like this. And then done. You'll see that I have three weapons in my inventory. And you can trade any weapon for this from the mystery box or off the walls. You have any three weapons that you want at once. The bitches get bitches in Modern Warfare 2. They give us an edge and help us see through. We dominate the battlefield with the tricks we do. Glitches get bitches in Modern Warfare 2. I'm in the game, it's Modern Warfare 2. Okay, so now guys, let's do the save and quick glitch. When you go ahead and die, just like this, you'll see on the screen. I'm gonna make myself die. And I'm talking about when you fully die, watch this. So when you fully die. Notice it's round 16, right? All right, there we go, I'm dead. Before the animation cuts off, you're gonna go to the poor screen, you're gonna go to the home screen, and you're gonna start another game. Don't exit the app or anything, just start another game straight away. This will glitch out the game, thinking that you like something happened with the game, whatever. I just use FIFA for this one. Now when we go back to Black Ops 6, watch this. All right, now we're back in. We're gonna go back to Zombies. So as you can see here, last played Black Ops 6 Zombies. And then we go to the save file. So go down to save file. And you'll see Liberty Falls round 16 is saved. And you can go ahead and start that up. It expires in 28 days. I'm at the top of leaderboards and I'm on fire. If they say you don't like glitches, then I say that you're a liar. Okay, so the operator skin glitch is still working as well. As you can see right here, it's after the patch and I just equipped this guy right here, Klaus. I got him for free and I did this after the patch as well. So we're gonna be showing you exactly how to do that now. Very simple, very easy. All you need is a uh, mouse to plug into your console, that's it. So once you plugged in the mouse, come to the operator that you want and right click the operator that's locked. So I'm gonna show you on Rossi right now. I'm gonna right click her, but I'm gonna hold the right click button down and drag it to a uh, character that I have unlocked and I'm gonna let go of the right click right here. Then the customizer is gonna come up. You're gonna click that, come over to the locked character again, hold down with a right click, but don't uh, let go. Bring it out to the blue and on the controller, you're gonna press X, X, circle, and keep holding down the right click while you press square to equip the character, square. That's it, the glitch has worked, you're back out, and now when you come back to operators, look who's equipped, it's Rossi. Now if you wanna keep seeing hectic glitches like this, then make sure you subscribe with notifications on so you're the first one to watch and you don't miss out. It's been my pleasure to show these glitches. See you guys tomorrow, Joey Rums out.